But it sounds like this. Hi guys, Yuri here again. Welcome to YB Plays Music. Today I'm gonna show you the karate chop and plant technique for muting your guitar. I already showed you a couple of techniques when it comes to muting your guitar the last couple of weeks. Today I'm gonna show you the karate chop and the plant technique for muting your guitar. They're pretty similar, but the karate chop is more used for chords and on electric guitar when you're using a plectrum. The plant technique is more when you play fingerstyle. So what is a karate chop? Like the name says it itself, with a karate chop you use the side of your hand to hit the strings right here and it's used with your right hand so we're gonna chop our right hand right here on the strings and that is actually to stop the sound and then to play it right again so for example when I play a chord to stop it I karate chop with my right hand it's a very common method to stop a chord or to stop a song at the end like this but with the karate chop technique we're basically going to play a chord right after as well I'm just gonna use the same chord just for an example but it sounds like this you can use different rhythms of course but this is an example so we stop the sound by karate chopping and then release when we play the strings again and you can use this of course in combination with other different muting techniques which makes it pretty interesting to listen to of course now for the plant technique I'm gonna remove my plectrum because I cannot do the plant technique with my plectrum now let's for example take the D chord you can use any chord you want but I'm gonna use the D chord in its first position right here of course my guitar has a little bit of distorted sound it just sounds cooler I think but with the D chord we're playing the four lower strings and I can just play it right like this with my thumb but what I'm gonna do for this technique is I'm gonna use my thumb, index finger, middle finger and my ring finger and that way I can play all the strings of the chords like this I'm also doing that because afterwards I can plant the four fingers I use here right away on the same strings to stop the sound like this and the sound stops the same like with the karate chop I can play the notes just right after again like this alright so this technique can be used on acoustic classical guitar electric it's actually possible on every different kind of guitar I think so those are two similar techniques but if you play the majority of the time with a plectrum I assume karate chop will be the technique that you will use most of the time all right so guys I hope you learned something again today don't forget to subscribe like and share the video next week I'm gonna show you how to use your right hand when you're starting fingerstyle guitar playing so stay tuned for that one also don't forget I have other tutorials I have reaction videos and music videos for you guys to check out so thank you very much and see you guys next time. Bye. I showed you... I already showed you... Uh, the pot... And that is actually to, to and that is actually to and that is actually to stop a chord. We're basically you can use different met so it's just, st the A chord. Let's for the um, but the D chord is the but uh, and the stop. I can play the string. I can play this. I can play tutorials. I have music videos and also don't.